What's up, Zombie Slayers? Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ48, and welcome back to Seven Days to Die. And it's almost day five. We are just up here in the base, just kind of hanging and banging. Um, I am making myself a... Oh, I already did it. I made myself a hunting knife. Now, the stun baton does a lot more damage than the hunting knife. So, but like, look at the amount of... Look at the difference in the stamina cost. Uh, the hunting knife has the sneak damage. Um, 24 power attack damage. The power attack damage isn't as bad. Ah, boy. I kind of feel like the stun baton's still better, I'm going to be honest. And this thing still needs repair kits. Uh, but I am specced into hunting knives. Now, when you spec into a skill, I, I could be wrong about this, but I don't think it reflects in the weapon's damage. So, I have points in agility, okay, which, um, uh, about 5% chance... Okay, so it doesn't give me any more damage. You're clumsy uh, as they come, but you still do 200% headshot damage and a 5% chance... Oh, 200% headshot damage with knives. Now, that doesn't reflect in the knife damage, I don't think. I'm pretty sure it doesn't. So, the fact that... And plus, I've got one point in the deep cuts, which uh, does more damage with knives, inflict bleeding. I'm going to go with the knife, uh, even though the stun baton has a lot more damage to it. But, you know... Uh, I think we're gonna try it. If if I don't, if I feel like the knife's weak, you know, and I gotta wait for more stats. Oh, you can't put a weighted head mod in the, in the knife. Damn, dude. All right, um, I'm gonna go with the knife. If I feel like it's a little weak, then we'll, you know, we'll go back to the stun baton. It's fine. Uh, I guess I might as well put the weighted head mod in there, or I could put it in here. Now let's just keep it in here. Just keep it safe. Keep it secret. Keep it safe. Okay. Um, I do have a bunch of nails. I think I'm going to take those nails and we're going to make some writable storage boxes. And that's not going to be for this episode, but that'll be for next episode. I think I might actually just go out and start questing during the night. I don't, I don't really, well, I do see a reason not to, but I don't, I don't think it's going to stop me. Oh, there we go. Reload. No, can't reload. Okay. Sounds good to me. Um, we do have flashlight mods for guns. And I'm not seeing any other mods that would be for guns. That's for the that's for the helmet. All right. Um, although you might be able to put the hunter's mod on guns. Maybe. I don't know. Modify. Yeah, you can. See? That's what I'm talking about. So we're going to beef up the pistol. Um, should I, like, stop using this? Um, the pistol's pretty dope. Although it does do less damage, less magazine size, less rounds, less range. Man, the pipe freaking <laughs> the pipe machine gun's pretty freaking dope, man. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this. I already have one in the bow. Yes, I do. So modify and we put that in there, and there we go. All right, cool. All right, like I said, we're gonna go out and do some questing now because I don't feel like waiting for morning. We're gonna go to House Old Ranch 04. All right, pretty far away, but we do have a bicycle, so no big deal. Uh, and the enemies are more dangerous at night, even in my world, because uh, you get harder enemies and they run faster. So, yeah, um, we just we got to be on the ball. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so we got to come up here and to uh, the right, and we got to watch our stamina because we are not on any kind of motorized, you know, vehicle. There's a guy. We're gonna we're gonna go right by him. Later, Gator. Yeah, this is going to be a little nervous, but, you know, uh, I will do some sneaking. See, the cool thing about nighttime is uh, you can sneak a lot more effectively. So, I only have one point in the sneaking. I've got some heavy armor. Probably won't be able to sneak that well, but, you know, we'll see. We'll see. You never know. Like, I mean, the nighttime makes a big difference when sneaking. Like, more than you would think. Uh, more than I would think, anyway. All right, I can sneak attack this lady real easily, but I kind of want to try out the knife. Hey! Okay, she's got all kinds of bleeds on her. So I guess I could just run her around. I mean, she gets like... Is, am I reading this right? Deeper cuts. Uh, you can inflict up to three... You can inflict up to three bleed wounds on an enemy and a power attack of inflicts two. So with two power attacks, I've got three bleeds, which is the max I can do. Do I have that right? I think I do. Let's see. Okay. Well, that went pretty well. I don't love this POI, to be honest. Oh, good. That's not that POI. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Oh. Okay. I don't really recognize this place. Doesn't mean I've never been here. I just don't recognize it. Uh, how am I supposed to get in there? There's got to be a way to ride my bike in there, right? 
Um, I do want my bike in the POI area because, you know, if I need to get, like, healed or anything, all my healing stuff's on my bike. I heard something. Is it that per that thing? Yeah. It's that guy. Oof, I really don't want to ride the bike all the way in there, though, to be honest. So I'm not going to. Okay. Let's be silent. Silent but deadly. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Ride the bike over here, right? Yeah, that's a much better place for the bike. Alrighty. We're gonna check out this barn first. Or shed. Whatever you want to call it. I don't think there's anything in here. All right, which is fine by me. I'll put that up there. We're going to grab this. We're going to break into this bad mamma jamma. And then we're going to wrench that that workbench. Oh, a blue item? That's worth repairing. <laughs> wow. That, oof. Oh, my goodness. No, only $4.98? Probably because I don't have any points into better bartering. I might actually wait until I get some points into better bartering before I sell that thing. But damn, freaking blue item, man. I wonder if we're getting some kind of bonus because it's nighttime. I don't think you get bonuses in this game because of nighttime. Loot station only 23. That's just an incredibly lucky find. Okay. Oops, leave that off. All right, looks like we've got to go up here. Come on. Okay. Yeah, this doesn't look familiar to me. I'm pretty sure I've been here. It looks kind of familiar, but not like super duper familiar. If that makes any sense. Probably not. All right. Uh -huh. Oh, there's a mine right there. So that's going to be fun. That's going to wake up everything in the area. Let me make sure my guns are loaded. They are. Yeah, there's mines all over the place over here. See, even if you have that thing where you, if you, you can step on... Oh, boy. Yep, and that just woke up everything. Or did it? Did that not wake up everybody? Huh. Okay. My sneaking skill sucks, by the way. To be expected. Uh, now, the thing is, even if you can walk on those landmines, you're not, not worried about that. Uh, the zombie can set off the landmine and kill you. Uh, you don't believe me? Well, it's happened to me before. So, yeah. There's a lot of cobblestone up here. I just walked over this floor thing and it fell away. And there's like 50 zombies down there that just went ape shit. I'm not sure if they can get up here or not. I'd imagine they could. I just don't know how good their pathing is going to be. So I'm just going to continue getting this stuff. I walked over and I heard creak and I was like, oh shit. And I ran off it before it fell. But like, then I saw like a bunch of zombies down there, like coming up here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to break this out and then I'm going to put this across it. Yeah. They, I don't think they know how to get up to me. They can get up to me if they, if they understood, but they don't. Well, maybe they do. We'll see. All right, hold on. Let's go out here and see what's going on. It sounds like... Here, let's just do this. That way, <laughs> maybe they won't be able to get past that. All right, I will continue getting cobblestone. You sound pretty close. Yep. Okay, so one made it. All right, run away. <laughs> Is she going to bleed out down there? I'm not sure how strong that bleed really is. Yep, she bled out. Okay. All right, that was pretty funny. <laughs> how you like my bleed effect, lady? All right, now let's see if we can kill the others. I don't know how she got up and the rest can't. I'm not really sure what's going on down there. Um, yeah, we should probably handle it down here. Where we got some space to move around. How did she get out here? Was she already outside? I wonder if she just happened to be outside. Alright, I guess I'm not going to worry about it. 
Why should I worry about it, right? Let's just drop down this freaking pit of death and see what we can do. Here, hold on, I got an idea. Alright, come on back, guys. They might have lost me. They might have lost me. Uh, yeah, I think part of that sneak skill is they lose you quicker. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's part of the sneak skill. Like, um, something about them, you know, they'll only follow you for a certain amount of time. I'm not sure if they lost me yet, but they could have. We gotta go. Alright. <laughs> Being careful. <laughs> I will not. Oh, finally! Nerd glasses! F yeah. You know, I was just thinking, do I want to use those goggles or not? I was kind of going back and forth in my mind, but now screw it. Nerd glasses. Now, am I going to lose anything? That is an agility. I might lose stuff because of that. Am I losing anything in the agility tree? I am not, because I didn't take advantage of that point. So... That's great. Now with the ner nerd glasses, we are getting intellect, crafting time, and experience gain. Best glasses in the game, in my personal opinion. All right. Uh, sell that. Sell that. Okay. Take this out quietly. Oh, look at that. Wait, a ladder? Am I supposed to be able to get in there or something? It's kind of weird there's a ladder in there. I hear them. I just don't know where they are. I think they're downstairs. Going on ninja. Guys, if you find this ninja stuff boring, please let me know. Damn it. Damn it. Okay. All right, we're all right. <laughs> also, on the other hand, if you guys find this ninja stuff incredibly exciting, let me know. To be fair, even if you don't like it, it will get better as I put points into the sneak skill. I'll be able to move a lot quicker, and I think that'll really help. Also, like I said, nighttime. If I'm sneaking, there's gonna be a lot of nighttime looting. Shit. Come on, bro. Bleed out. Bleed out. Bleed out! He's bleeding. He's bleeding like a stock pig. Love it. I probably won't use that bleed effect that much. It's, you know, it's just, it's fun. It's a novelty. Right. Nope. Oh, that looks like something I need. If there's any zombies down there, they are screwed. I will be death from above. Although I'm not seeing any. They put them on angles where you can't get to them. Anything my compass? No. Great. Just great. Can I go over this way? Oh, I can. Huh. Not seen anybody. Oh, what the hell is an arrow down here? I must have missed somebody. <laughs> I know this makes a lot of noise, but what else? Oh, hold on. Shit. Fuck me. Uh, probably not a good idea to go running through the building. Just gonna throw that out there. Alright. Hey, look, we didn't go to guns. 
I am very impressed with that. I'm not impressed with me running around like an idiot, um, waking up more zombies, but I am impressed that I didn't have to go to guns. All right, what do you got? Don't care. Love the, uh... I've been getting an unbelievably large amount of, of, uh... Oh, you get the torch back for that? Oh, hold on. Yeah, I can make torches, whatever. Anyway, I'm getting a lot of honey in this game, which is awesome. Because I don't have that fist of cuffs. For those of you who don't know, when you do brawler build, if you punch zombies in the mouth, it knocks out their teeth and you cannot be infected. Uh, and I'm not using brawler this, this season, so it's nice to have a way to kind of cure that. Alright. Uh, we don't need those two. I hear something walking around. Oh, that's a big boy. He's not part of the POI. I should probably deal with him before we move along in the POI. So I'm just going to loot while he breaks in. And get myself nice and encumbered. Probably not the best idea. Alright, let's deal with him. I'm going to drop stuff. Oh, I don't know. If I do I want to do a drop chest? Oh, shit. I don't like the sound of that. Hold on. I don't like the sound of the dogs. Hey, right, come on, tough guy. Damn it, he run right through it. Okay. Alright, that dog's gonna get blasted in this stupid freaking mutt face. Oh, I just dropped those, didn't I? Whatever, it's fine. Alright. Wait, is that like a dog horde or something? Huh. I'm not too sure I like that. We need some life ladders. Freaking dog hordes. Okay. Uh, really quickly. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything here about dog hordes. Yeah, it's just regular stuff. Just regular stuff. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, you know what? I don't think I have any room in my... Uh... Yeah, we're going to have to make a drop chest. Let's just do it. Let's just bite the bullet. Oh, shit. Hold on. Hey, right, he's dead. Actually, he's got more hit points. He might not be dead. You gonna bleed out, bro? I don't know how long the bleeding lasts for, you know? Does it last until they're dead, or...? Okay, that's taking too long. The cool thing is I can power attack all fucking dead. Like, this thing went... Oh, is he a feral? Okay. Um, the thing is, uh, I get, even though, like, I don't... My, my knife does do a lot of damage, I can just power attack, you know, forever. Oh, yeah, that's a dog horde. That's a mother freaking dog horde. Do you believe this? The thing is, they're right where I want to make the drop chest. All right, let's see if we can, de let's see if we can deal with this. Shit, he didn't die. <laughs> Not good. Not good. I don't know if he saw me, though. Let's give myself a little platform up here. All right, should be relatively safe where we are. Oh, God, there's like five of them out here. They're like ants. All right, one's down. Man, this is going to be a lot of bones. Actually, you know what? Come at me. Are you going, Fido? Come on, guys. What are you doing? Come on. You know, I think this thing has a certain amount of range. And I think it's out of range. There we go. Sneak damage, baby. All right, we got a bunch of dogs down. Okay. And I think there's another one over there. But I can deal with one... One dog surprise. I don't want to deal with five dog surprises. Okay. One cool thing about this. Um... Yeah, it sounds like we're going to have to deal with some zombies. Hold on. One cool thing about using knives is that uh, I can um, I can use the knives to take care of animals. Just 
gonna break through it. There we go. Come on. Alright, you're dead. Alright, oh, here we are. What's up, Edgar? Ain't seen you in forever. Alright, you're dead. Alright, let's go do i I'm trying to do a drop chest for the past 10 minutes. Let's go do this. Okay, killed a couple more dogs, put down a drop chest. Let's check this for some schematics. <gasps> Oh, puffer coats. Boo. Boo. I want the double pocket mods, damn it. All right. We should be able to just about finish this place. I'm pretty sure there's only one zombie left. All right, you. All right, hold on. You got this. You can do it. There you go. I love the way you could power attack with this thing. Like, just all day, man. All freaking day. Oh, that was not the last zombie. Okay. Well, I <laughs> guess we're going to be looking for the last zombie again. Uh, scrap that. I like the engine. That's not bad. Let's go ahead and grab this. All right. What do we got here? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yep. There's one over here. Not one in there, right? I didn't think so. You always get the arrows back when you when you do that, by the way. Oh, okay. There's gonna be more than one down here. Guaranteed. Yep, I could see three on my compass right now. I don't think shooting him in the ankle is gonna work unless his name is Achilles. Hmm. I'm not sure where the other ones are. That one's close. Yeah, I wasn't sure. I figured it was worth a shot. All right, we'll do the door trick. Come on, buddy. Come on. One of these can come through. All right. Taking some hits, but that's okay. Whoa, that was a big miss. Big miss by old KG48. Let's let her bleed out a little bit. We'll do some looting while she bleeds. Come on, show me that experience. And she ain't bleeding out. <laughs> she has too many hit points. Okay, well she's dead now. Was she a feral? Like... Does Big Bertha give them that much experience normally? I don't, I don't... I'm not sure. I am not sure. Uh, before we go any farther, let's loot some of the stuff we've passed up. Let's grab some of this. A little bit of this. A little bit of that. A little bit of this, because this is where it's at. Yeah. I'm a rapper, bro. Uh, we got over here. Can we take these? No, we're just going to get clay, right? Eh, it's not really worth it for the clay. You get better clay at home. Uh, we'll definitely eat that. And we will throw away this. Okay, don't need any blueberries. We looted everything in here. Did we loot everything out here? Um, nope. All right. I don't, is the grill worth anything? Like, I don't think any, I don't think the grill's used for anything. I'm pretty sure I didn't loot anything in here. Yep, yeah, okay. Yeah, we need some we need some leather. Guys, you remember the, remember when you used to have to refine stuff? You'd gr you'd get this stuff and then turn it into leather. The, the problem with that was back in the day where you just turn stuff into other things, wood into sticks, uh, you know, hide into leather, is there wasn't any like process to it, you know? Am I supposed to get anything for this? No. That's not that's not what I was thinking it was. Uh imagine if like imagine if when you get like leather, it's called leather, but it really should be called hide. Imagine when you get hide if you had to like get a tanning rack and then tan it into leather. That'd be cool. But back in the day, the fun pimps just had it where you just clicked one button and it automatically went into leather. If you're just gonna click one button and it's automatically gonna go into leather, yeah, you might as well just get rid of that like hide step and just give leather. But I think it would have been cool to have a tanning rack. A lot of games do that. Some of this. Uh, are we gonna get anything good for this? Yep. Yep, that's a nice one right there. Damn it. 
Why did I break that open? I have no I have no intention of breaking into that safe. Uh, not at this level. It's just not going to... I mean, it could have something good in it, but it's pretty low chance. I don't have a lot of lockpicks, and I don't even think I have any jailbreakers on me. So... Okay. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah, I might as well grab this while we're here. Get the radiator. All right, I think we're going to go downstairs now. If I can find my way... Okay, here we are, here we are. All right, time for the big time loot. Not this stuff, but we will be getting to the big time loot shortly. Oh, it's down there, that's right, okay. Yeah, I have been down here before, but I, I don't know if I've been here since they redid the place. I love what you've done with the place. What the hell's back here? Oh, is there gonna be something back here? Oh yeah. Weapons and bodies and guns. Oh my. It looks like there's guns in there. There should be guns in there. Not just uh, gun parts, I guess. It's fine. All right. I'm going to break those up. I'm going to drink that. And then I'm going to throw out that jar. And that's got a recipe attached. So I will hold off. Although I don't expect to be able to make any recipes anytime soon. But still. I'll only eat those canned food that have recipes when I have to. It just makes sense. It's funny. I remember when I remember when they first made that change to where you needed those canned foods for the recipes. I was eating the canned food because we always used to. And people were yelling at me for eating the canned food. Don't eat the canned food. So then I stopped eating the canned food because it's the right thing to do. And then people started yelling at me. Why aren't you eating the canned food? I'm like, guys, please. <laughs> uh, repair that. Uh, after... After getting hit, brawling attacks are 20% faster. Yeah, that doesn't really matter to me, but I will read it anyway, because why not? All right, got some ammo here. And let's break into these suckers. We got a cracker book and a shaka messiah. Shaka messiah. All right. Uh, well, that's unbelievably useless to me. Uh, that's, you know, cell and iron arrowheads aren't bad. All right, let's see what we get for a quest reward. So, now that you have some money to spend, oh. we're ready to that is, damn it, damn it, Jen. <laughs> the shotgun would be a really nice way to use my shotgun shells. I'm not in love with the dollar belt shotgun, but it's 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 okay. Um, although, the 109 mil ammo is more important, especially considering I'm specced into pistols. Uh, antibiotics would be really good too, but I'm gonna have to go with the um, with the nine mil. Oh, I didn't expect this to happen so quick. Damn it, mini bike parts bundle. I, how many times are I going to get burned on this? Man, 500 cobblestone. Oh, boy. That could really help. I'd prefer it to be wood, to be honest. You know, I got to gamble, guys. I'm sorry. I'm a gambler. Uh, I'm just, I'm a gambler. It's just, yeah. it's just what I do. Uh, do hurry. I have a All right, Jen. Uh, you have not restocked any time recently, so let's go ahead. You want to put a point in a better bartering yet? Okay, then. Uh, how much of a... Full, uh, get 5% better deal. Mm, doesn't seem that good. I'm going to hold off on the points. Uh, but I will sell stuff. Okay. Sell, sell, sell. Sell, 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 sell. Would you want to buy this? No. <laughs> I didn't think so. I wouldn't have sold it anyway. All right, let's... Guys, fingers supply. crossed. Can we please get something for this? <gasps> is that everything? That's everything. That's freaking everything. I'm going to have a mini bike next episode. Holy shoot. That is awesome. Well, you know what, guys? It burned me a couple times in the past, but this time it uh, it all worked out. All right. I am going to call this one here. If you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time, and until then, take it easy.